U.S. President Joe Biden flew into the G20 summit in New Delhi. With Vladimir Putin and Xi Jinping absent, he'll be hoping to make his stamp on the gathering of the world's wealthiest nations. If we are indeed one global family, we today resemble a rather dysfunctional one. Divisions are growing, tensions are flaring up, and trust is eroding, which together raise the spectre of fragmentation and ultimately confrontation. The chairman of the African Union could be in the spotlight even as Russia's war on Ukraine casts its shadow. India's Prime Minister Narendra Modi wants the African Union to be a permanent G20 member. The summit in New Delhi will last for two days.